everybody. I am Janet and today we are in the Mother Goose Club Playhouse Kitchen and I am joined by my friends Anna Grace. Hello. And my friend Lucas. Hi. Today we are making pizza. pizza. Yes. 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 We made our dough and now it is time to roll out our crust. Now what we want to do is we want to put a little bit of flour on our rolling pin that way the dough won't stick to it so much. Let's get to rolling here. Here is a trivia question. Does anybody know who invented pizza? Gooey Lou. Gooey Louie, I love that name. I don't think he has anything to do with pizza. Uh, do you have a guess? I have no idea. His name was Rafael Esposita, June 11th, 1889, and he was making a pizza for Queen Margarita of Savoy. And so on it, he put tomato sauce, basil, which is green, and mozzarella cheese. So you have red, green, and white, which were the colors of Italy. Uh, we will give uh, Rafael Esposito some credit today for making pizza. All right, so I think that I'm good, but it's like I... Oh, I don't like it! <laughs> you guys give it a try, that's kind of fun. It's kind of like action, like a Frisbee. Yeah. Wow, that's good stuff. Oh yeah, one last twirl. So we have made our pizza crust. They're all looking very, very delicious. Now, what do you suppose is the first thing we need to do? We need to put pizza sauce on. All right, so with that said, everybody grab a spoon and pizza sauce away. All right, so once you're fine with how much sauce you have on there, all right, you guys are good with that? All right. Now we're going to talk about the ingredients we can put on top of our pizza. Now, you mentioned put that you like what on your pizza? Pepperoni and cheese. All right. So are you going to put your cheese on first or your pepperoni? Cheese. All right. So away you go. Now, what, are you, what would you like to put first on your pizza? You know, I think I'm going to do something really funky. I'm going to put my cheese on last. Ah, oh, very, very creative cool. here. All right, so what would you like to go with first? Probably bacon. <laughs> All right, so she's going to put a bit of bacon. Now, I am going to go uh, the route of Chef Lucas over here, put a little cheese. Have you guys ever had avocado on a pizza? Is Not that a pizza. what you make guacamole out of? It is what you make guacamole out of, but I love avocado, so I'm gonna put a little avocado here. So you're gonna go for a little pepper there, a little orange bell pepper. I think that's a good idea. Now, where are you gonna go from here? Um, sausage. All right. Oh my goodness, all of this smells so good. I just wanna like eat it. Ah, it won't <laughs> be long now. And uh, so I've got my peppers, I've got my avocado. I might go with a little more cheese. I might, oh, you know what, I forgot. That looks really yummy. And then I'm gonna put some black olives on there just for good measure. There we go. All right, so now it is time to put the pizzas in the oven. Can you say, la pizza? La, la pizza. pizza. In the oven. In the <laughs> oven. <laughs> you always wanna be careful with the oven and have some assistance with that. And now we will set our timer. All right, and we wait. Oh goodness, this is Lucas's pizza. We're gonna put that right there. This is Anna Grace's pizza. And then this is my pizza. <laughs> Do these so not look amazing? And they smell fantastic, don't oh, they? Yes. Uh, are you proud of your creation? I think it's gonna be really good. All right. And you're excited to try yours? So good. I say it's time to cut into these pizzas and let's have a bite. I think the word for the day is bon appetit. Everybody try a bite of your pizza. All right. <laughs> That's pretty good, guys. How about yours? <laughs> it's like, oh, it's a little hot. So, no, it's a little hot. All right. So we have a few <laughs> final words for you. <gasps> bon appetit. <laughs> we'll see you next time, Mother Goose. See Gishka. you next time. <laughs> <laughs> Are you willing to try some avocado there for me? I'll try it. All right, come on, Lucas. Would you say that an avocado is a vegetable or a fruit? A um, fruit? It is a fruit. It's actually a single seeded berry. Okay, so how about a little bite of onion? Wow, onion is very delicious. <gasps> oh, it's kind hot. spicy. Oh, it's hot to oh, you. A little bit of an anchovy here. This is a fish cured in uh, salt and oil. Anybody brave enough to try this with me? Oh, really? 
really salty, really fishy. Super fishy. <laughs> Kinda tastes like the aquarium smells. Hey Mother Goose Club, today we're gonna do the Oreo challenge. So the rules are, you you eat an Oreo and you describe what you taste. And if you get it wrong, remember the bean boozle? This tastes so bad. We're gonna eat one of the bean boozles. Let's get started, so let's put our blindfolds on. Here's cookie number one. Zion. So cookie number one was a cinnamon cookie. Yeah, that was number Ooh. one. We got it right. All right, let's Bobby, move on. Give me a pop. Hey. All right, now cookie number two. Chocolate. Yeah, chocolate cream. That's very chocolatey. Chocolate cream. Chocolate cream it is. Yeah. All right, let's move on to cookie number three. Oh man, you guys are gonna get all sugared up. It tastes like pumpkins. Like mm -hmm. pumpkin. A pumpkin cinnamon spice? Yeah, pumpkin cinnamon spice. Pumpkin spice cream, all yeah. right. Have you guys had enough? No. no. Of course not. All right, cookie number four. Mint, 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 mint all day, mint all day, mint, mint cream Oreo all day. Yay! I'm throwing the egg. No, no, don't throw it at me. All right, cookie number five. How would it taste? Birthday cake. Yeah, birthday cake. Birthday cake. Hold on, I can't describe the mint stuff is still in my mouth. Birthday cake. All right, that cookie was red velvet. What the, uh, what? Yeah, red velvet Oreo. Yeah, we get one. Okay. Ugh, it tastes like baby wipes. I don't want Baby? It tastes like baby wipes. All right, cookie number six. You ready? Blindfold, put your blindfolds on. Corn. We have three more cookies. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Here we go. Six. I see you. Cookie number six. Cookie number six. Cheerio, cheerio, food. Yeah, food. Cheerio, food. Birthday cake. Birthday cake. And that cookie was lemon cream. What? <sighs> I know it tastes something like lemon. I know this. <sighs> Yeah, it kind of did taste like fruit loops. Where's my cookie? Oh, we haven't done yet. Whose hand is this? This is your father's hand. Oh, yeah. Father. Gross. All right, you ready for cookie number seven? Regular cookie, but chocolate cookie. Yeah, regular cookie. Uh, yep, regular and what chocolate, chocolate cookie. And regular and chocolate cookie. Chocolate. All right, original Oreo. Good job. Yes. Wait, is it the chocolate one? Yes, the original chocolate. Baby. Are we done? One more cookie. Good. All right, remember to get the blindfold on. Yes. Do some pop locking first. Mm -hmm. Pop lock. Alright, here you go. Last and final cookie. The ruckus. This is the ruckus. There's something in my hand. I, um, it's the original. It's the original cookie, but it's coated. No, this one's birthday cake. This one's so nice. Yeah, this one's birthday cake. Yeah, and the this. King said, what, what flavor is it? Yeah, I think birthday cake. Birthday cake. Mm -hmm. Birthday cake all day. Birthday cake! Yes. Happy birthday!
happy birthday to you. <laughs> and that is the Oreo challenge. Did you guys enjoy that? Yeah. Hey, Pete. Oh, hey. Happy birthday. We hope you guys had a fun time with us and enjoyed watching us. We'll see you again soon. From the ruckus, everybody say bye. Bye! This is what the birthday cake looked like. It has tiny sprinkles in it. Yeah, look at this. Oh! Bye-bye birthday. Hey, Monkey Goods Club. My name is Zion, and this is Diego from Kingston, and this is my dad. And today we're going to be doing the Bean Boozle Challenge. Let's get started. Hey, how about if daddy goes first? No. Yeah, daddy goes first. Yeah. I flick it. Alright, so I flick it. Yeah. Chocolate pudding. Or can dog, dog food. We all okay. can take it. I can't take it. Here we go. You ready? Drop <laughs> it. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Oh, okay. Chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you get? You got chocolate? I got, I got canned dog food. <laughs> no. No. My, My turn. My turn. Caramel corn or moldy cheese. Oh, ready? Thank you. Let's go. Ready. Or what? Moldy cheese. Oh. Go. Ah. <laughs> 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 uh, let me try mine. It's pretty gross. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> All right, Diego, your turn. <laughs> oh, Barker Pete. No. Oh. One, two, three, go. Go. <laughs> Mine was good. <laughs> Some spinach. It smells like macaroni and cheese. Oh, come on, uh, he got booger juicy pear and booger. Oh man. You guys like eating boogers, so that'll be easy. Kingston does. Kingston. One, One two, two, three. Finally! It's a bubble. Yes! Yes! Lime and mom clippings. 
joining us today on Mother Goose Club Playhouse. You have something for me to try today. So tell me about what you have in store for us. Okay, so today we're gonna do the Bean Boozled Challenge. We have a spinner, and each person will take turns spinning it. Mm -hmm. And then whatever the arrow lands on, each person will grab that color jelly bean. And if you cannot take it, then you know, you can just spit it out in here. So Ethan, would you like to go first? Okay, land on something good. Coconut or baby wipes? Coconut or baby wipes? On your mark, get okay. set, go. Oh, that, that definitely a baby wipe. But it's baby wipes. Baby <laughs> wipes. I'm gonna take it though. Cause it, hopefully we get oh, it. Oh, there's a big spin, uh-oh. Oh, tutti, fruity, or stinky socks? Please, no stinky socks. One, two, two three. three. Tootie fruity. Woo! <laughs> yes! No boozle in here. <laughs> Stinky sauce. Sorry. For the first time, I actually got tootie fruity. Tootie fruity. All right, may the bean boozlers be with me here. Here we go. Caramel corn <gasps> or moldy cheese. Here we go, everybody. One, two, two three. three. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back. I gotta brush my teeth. Oh, okay, of all the things I've ever eaten in the entirety of the known world, that might have been the worst. Come on, pick a good one. Peach or bar? Oh, no! I, I thought it couldn't get worse after moldy cheese. Let, let's go really slowly on this. One, two, three. That's exactly. Oh. <laughs> I, I gotta brush my teeth again. It's terrible. I'm a oh. <gasps> All right. So whose turn is it now? Mine. No. Chocolate pudding or canned dog food? Oh. Oh, it's the brown one. Okay, so here we go. Chocolate, please, oh, please be chocolate. Not chocolate, dog. chocolate, chocolate. Chocolate, hot dog food. One, One two, two, three. Uh, <laughs> uh, 
I'm glad I'm not a dog. So stick around, tune in again, and who knows what we'll be doing on Mother Goose Club Playhouse the next time. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Hello friends, my name is Janet and you are joining us today on Mother Goose Club Playhouse. Janet has something for me to try today, so tell me about what you have in store for us. Okay, so today we're going to do the Bean Boozled Challenge. We have a spinner and each person will take turns spinning it mm -hmm. and then whatever the arrow lands on, each person will grab that color jelly bean and if you cannot take it, then you know, you can just spit it out in here. Now it's my turn. Okay. <laughs> okay. Licorice or skunk spray? Come Good on! Good grief, kiddos! All right, okay. one, two, two. <laughs> three. three! Licorice, yay! Licorice, and for the first time in my life, I have, I'm not crazy about it, but my, did you get skunk? I can smell it. <laughs> How many more can there possibly be? <gasps> Berry, blue, or toothpaste. Mm. I don't really care which one it is. Berry, blue. I got blueberry. I got toothpaste. I think toothpaste is good. Have I missed a turn? It feels like I missed a turn. <gasps> no! No, 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 no. no what, 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 what? Lime or lawn clippings? suppose that would be the green one. <laughs> yes. One, two, three. <laughs> Definitely can taste the chlorophyll. Tastes like I just mowed the yard. Butter, popcorn, or rotten egg. Are you kidding me? Okay. Three, These, seven. Two, one, we're counting backwards. Oh. That is awful. That is, okay, hold on. I gotta splash water in my face with that. You haven't done juicy pear or booger. Yeah, so we haven't done booger. One, two, two three. three. Uh-uh. It's no stuck way. in my tooth, I can't get it out! Good grief! <laughs> so I think that if we were going to declare a champion of the bean boozling uh, thing here, that would be our big round of applause for the best boozler. All right, so stick around, tune in again, and who knows what we'll be doing on Mother Goose Club Playhouse the next time. See you next time! Bye! Bye. Hello Mother Goose Club! I'm here with my friends Darby and Ariana and we're going to be doing a Pringles taste test. Okay, you guys are going to have to put some blindfolds on. Alright. Okay. Okay, here's our first mystery Pringle. Whoa. <laughs> I've never had this one. Oh, it tastes good. I've never... Wow, I don't know this? what this would be. <laughs> I think it's dill. Is it like dill? Mm, or like is a it... dill pickle? Yeah. Kind of tastes like... I'm going to go with dill pickle. I don't know. Okay. Um, I'm going to go with sweet relish. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Mystery Pringle number two. I'm gonna go with barbecue sauce. Yeah, I think it's okay. barbecue. Yeah. Mystery Pringle number three. This one might be a little more tricky than the last one. Okay. I think it'll taste good though. Wait, what? <laughs> I don't know what I'm tasting. I don't either. <laughs> it tastes like, it doesn't have a flavor. It smells really good. Do you need to try um, another one? Mustard? <laughs> I think. Is that your guess? That's my guess. Okay. I think it's mustard. original. Original? Okay. Okay, mystery Pringle number four. Okay. Uh. Oh, wait. I 
know this, but I don't know what the word is. Like, oh, it smells like. It tastes like um chili. Yes, it's chili. Yeah, chili for sure, for sure. Do I have to finish this? Huh? Taking so long. No, you don't have to finish. Mm. It. You don't want to. <laughs> I like it. Mm -hmm. it tastes good. <laughs> okay, number five. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's ranch. Ranch? I would think this is the original. It just kind of tastes like potato mm, chips. Yeah. Are you changing, mm. your, are you changing mm. your answer? Um, yeah, I think I think this one is original. Yeah. It's a little salty. Number six. <laughs> I'm scared. Wait, I'm really clueless. Hmm. Just make a wild guess. Lemon, lime, uh, ranch. Lemon, okay. Lemon, lime, ranch? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just gonna go with ranch because I haven't guessed that one I yet. Still, and I, I still taste don't chili. Know. Is your mouth burning? Because <laughs> <laughs> if you know, my <laughs> mouth is not burning. Your mouth should not burn from a, a a chili flavored potato chip though. Okay, this <laughs> is know. number seven. Mm. Mm, this is a salt and so vinegar. Good. Salt and vinegar? Yeah, I think this is salt and vinegar. I think it's cheddar. Cheddar? Yeah. Okay. I really still have like so much flavors in my mouth. I know. I have no idea. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So this one is mystery pinkle number eight. <laughs> this is salt and vinegar. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> okay, this is mystery Pringle number nine. Sour cream and onion, mm -hmm. definitely. Oh yeah, oh my gosh, it's so good. Our last mystery Pringle, number 10. <laughs> Any guesses? Would this uh, be taco? I recognize <laughs> this flavor, but I don't know what it is. Mm -hmm. I think it's taco, or taco? cheeseburger. Or... Oh, cheeseburger, that's probably a good guess. I think I'm it's gonna go with taco. taco. taco? But I feel like I stole it from you. No, nah, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, now it's time to tally our scores and see who won the Pringle Taste Test Challenge. Okay, can we take off our blindfolds? Sure. For our first mystery Pringle flavor, Ariana, you guessed dill pickle, and Darby, you guessed sweet relish. And the flavor for the first mystery Pringle was cheeseburger. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> that totally tasted, tasted like um, well, well, you have dill, dill sauce. pickles on <laughs> cheeseburgers. For our second mystery Pringle, you guys both guessed barbecue, and you were right. For our third mystery Pringle, Ariana, you guessed mustard, and you guessed original. And the answer was honey mustard. No, so you, you got, you got it. Yes! You got it. That was smart. It wasn't even bad. I don't even like mustard. But it <laughs> tasted good. Mustard. And for our fourth mystery Pringle, you guys both guessed chili, and you were right. And for the fifth mystery Pringle, you guys both guessed original, and you guys were right again. And for our sixth mystery Pringle, you guessed ranch, and you guessed lemon lime ranch, and <laughs> the answer was zesty salsa. Oh, that was the lime. So you yeah. were kind of you were closer. I actually, was like the lemon lime ranch. ranch. Yeah, you were you were kind of close. <laughs> okay, and for our seventh mystery Pringle. You guessed cheddar and you guessed salt and vinegar, and the answer was ranch. What? Oh, this one's one of my favorites. I want to taste these again without being blindfolded and see if they taste different because <laughs> right. I know what it is. And for the eighth mystery Pringle, you guys both guessed salt and vinegar, and you were right. Okay, and for our ninth, you guys both guessed sour cream and onion, and you were right again. It was sour cream and onion. We didn't do too bad. No, you no, guys did we pretty good. Okay. You guys yeah. did pretty good. Yeah. Okay. And for our last one, you guys both guessed taco, but the answer was pizza. Pizza. What? <laughs> oh. I guess I can see that. Um, or taste that. Okay. And for our final scores, the winner is drum roll, please. Ariana. Yes. Good 
good job. Good it job. was really you close. Too. You had six and you had five. Okay. So it was it very was close. close call. Yeah. yeah. Very close. Good yeah. job. Good job. You too. Nailed it. Thank you for watching Mother Goose Club. Bye. Bye. It's been very quiet at the grocery store this morning. I hope I get some customers soon. Excuse me, sir. I like to buy a can of beans. Can you tell me where they are? The beans are right over there, ma'am. The green beans, black beans, red beans, and white beans are all on the same shelf. Thanks. Here's the can of green beans I wanted. Those are not green beans. Those are black beans. These are black beans? Let me show you. My cup is black. My cup and those beans are the same color. You want the beans the same color as this pepper. This pepper is green. Oh, whoops. I must have confused my colors. Thanks for your help. Glad to be of help. I found the green beans. Oh no, those are red beans. Really, I thought these were green beans. I'm afraid not. This tomato is red. This tomato and those beans are the same color. Those beans are red. This pepper is green. You want the beans the same color as this pepper. Oh, golly, I'll try again. I'm sure she'll get the right color of beans this time. Last, at last, here are the green beans. Oh no, those are white beans. You're joking, right? Nope, let me help. This piece of paper is white. This piece of paper and those beans are the same color. You want the beans the same color as this pepper. I think I've got it, I'll be right back. Do you think she'll finally get the right color of beans? I looked really carefully this time. I'm sure these are green beans. Let me see. Are these beans the same color as this pepper? They are! You found them! You found the green beans! Hooray! Thanks for teaching me my colors. Glad to be of help. That'll be two dollars. Thank you. There you go. Thank you. Have a nice day. You too. And you have a nice day too. Hello! Club. My name is Gianna. Today on Playhouse Challenge, we're going to play a new game called The Taste Test. Let's meet our contestants, Ethan and Maggie. Hi! We're going to be blindfolded and eat different types of mystery foods. And then we'll try to guess the mystery foods we just ate. After we taste test a mystery food, We'll give a point to the person who guesses correctly. Ready? Let's begin. The first food is apples. How does that feel in your hand? Smooth, kind of point. Feels like it has a stick on top. Round, and it feels like it might be Shiny. How does it smell? Fruity. Delicious. What color do you think it is? Green? Red. How does it taste? Sweet and juicy. Crunchy and sweet. What food do you think you just ate? A pear? An apple. Please lift up your blindfold and let's find out who guessed correctly. Maggie, you are correct. It was an apple. That means you get one point and Ethan gets no point. Sorry. Let's try another mystery food. Please put your blindfolds back on. The second mystery food is oranges. Go. 
How does that food feel in your hand? Bumpy, lumpy, and... Rough, ridgy, and spongy. How does it smell? Fresh, tropical. Smells like breakfast. Tangy, citrusy, and zesty. What color do you think it is? I think it's orange. I think it's yellow. And now, have a taste. Here you go. Here you go. What does this food taste like? Sweet, juicy, delicious. Sour, but also sweet. Very unique. What food do you think you just ate? I know, it's an orange. No, it's definitely a lemon. Please put your forks down and lift up your blindfold. The correct food is oranges. Ethan gets one point. Sorry, Maggie, you get no point. It's a tie game. Okay, let's get ready for our last mystery food. Please put your blindfolds back on. The last mystery food is peaches. Here you go. Here you go. How does this food feel in your hand? Hairy, fuzzy, kind of tickles your fingers. Squishy, soft, and very fuzzy. How does it smell? Yummy. It kind of smells like my favorite fruit pie. What color do you think it is? Pink, yellow, Orange? There you go. What does this food taste like? It's too mushy and feels like I'm eating a slug. This is delicious, quite peachy. What food do you think you just ate? I think I just ate a pink slug. I know I just ate a peach. Okay, please put down your forks and lift up your blindfolds. The correct answer is peaches. That means Maggie is our grand prize winner of yes. today's Playhouse Challenge. Yes. Good job, Ethan. Good, Good job, job, Maggie. Thanks. Good job, Maggie. I tasted so many delicious foods today, but my favorite was definitely the peach. My favorite was the orange. And remember to eat a rainbow of fruits and vegetables every day. Thanks for playing with us on today's Mother Goose Club Playhouse Challenge. Bye, Bye Mother Goose, Goose Club. Mother Goose Club Playhouse.